All right, hey everyone. We, this is our 2001 uh, Palomino pop-up. And today we wanted to show you some of the uh, inside renovations that we've done. Uh, we just bought this right going into the uh, kind of quarantine time. And we wanted to have a project to get going. We've been wanting to go in for a while. So the timing seemed appropriate for us to be able to get it done. And now we're gonna show you some of the cool things that we accomplished on the inside. Whoa, 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 now that before pictures. So this is our pop-up camper. We, uh, as you can see, we've, we've done quite a lot in the short time that, that we've had it. We reupholstered all of the, all of the cushions so that it had sort of a, kind of a newer look to it. If you uh, look from at the old pictures, you'll see that there used to be a sink here. We, we didn't want to use the sink uh, we didn't want to have to deal with the water tank, so we wanted to still use the space, so we removed the sink, kind of rebuilt the cabinet, and uh, put the microwave in it so that it didn't take up the valuable countertop space. Uh, obviously, we covered all of the uh, countertops. We repainted all of the furniture, new hardware, new handles, new hinges. We painted the fridge. We, we also recovered and redid the surface on, on the stove here so that it would match everything, even though it'll probably be outside more than inside. Uh, new curtains, we replaced all the curtains. We made these ones with fabric that we that we found and we, we ordered the blackout curtains. We bought these from Amazon. It was just as cheap to, to just get them and sew in the tabs for the curtains than it was to, to make new ones. New bedding and new pillows. We redid all of the flooring with just the peel and stick vinyl tiles from we picked up at Home Depot. One box was enough to do the entire floor, so not too, not too costly on there. We did add the, the quarter round molding at the bottom just to kind of give it that, that cleaner look. And the tables, uh, we really, we just spray painted the tables. Um, we, we liked the way that, we didn't like the kind of the cover that was on them before. Uh, really, we didn't have to do anything mechanical or anything repair. The, the, the previous owners had uh, kept everything in, in really good shape. All of the canvas on the outside was in good shape. The ceiling is on the in shape. Uh, in addition to our, to our microwave oven, we also built in, uh, used some of the space for a paper towel holder on the side over there, just to sort of have some of that space Uh, the table legs we just spray painted with with black just so that it matched. We did buy new uh, new pieces for the legs, new um, rubber caps for the bottom so that they so that it all matched. Just about everything we got we bought on Amazon, including this black trim and the contact paper for the countertops. Uh, we did uh, use a cabinet spray paint so that it had a little bit harder coat when it finished. We did primer underneath it. We sprayed it instead of brusher and rollered it. I'm not sure if that was. Spray I'm not sure if it was better or not. Um, um, we also added in a projector so that at night we can watch uh, movies and during football season we can still watch football games when they come on on the weekends. Uh, we just ran all of the electrical uh, and the HDMI cable back through the wiring so that we didn't have wires hanging everywhere. Um, and then we added in a 
pull down projection screen. When it gets a little darker, I'll, uh, I'll add to the video so that you can see what it looks like when it's running. Uh, we, we just put this through with some some bolts and cotter pins so that we could take it down and add, and kind of remove it as, as we put the pup down so that nothing got smashed. It also has a stand so that we can take it outside if we want to watch movies outside under the stars while we are camping. One big wide view here of everything. All right, now that it's a little bit darker, we wanted to show you the projector and the screen. So there's the screen down. We have it set up so that we can run it directly from our cell phones or you can run it from a Fire Stick or a Chromecast. And when it's really dark outside and uh, the light's not coming through the skylight there, it really shows up clear. But you, you can see even with, with some Rose light, Steve, it's still pretty great. Anything about you if you're not on here or on Instagram or Instagram? No! I want to go back. I, I changed my mind. Just give me a second. Meow Obama or... And now we can have movie nights when we're camping or watch football games or anything else okay, that we can so stream through our phone our or through Fire Stick or Roku or Chromecast. watching and we hope you like what you see comment down below if you have any uh, questions and I'll try to get back to you with answers